nighttime is when all the critters come out. And honestly, that's probably the bulk of our clientele because we're open pretty late. Yeah. We get the creepy crawlies at night that want to come and, you know, get drunk at one yeah. in the morning. Okay, okay. Um, those are the ones that uh, are our main clientele. So late night was super dead. Super dead. Um, we had a few people come in and just not have it at all. And we're just a little salty. They had to have it. I think guess they're thinking we wouldn't do it late at night. Like I didn't care anymore. Um, there was one guy that was all pissy because he didn't have his card with him. He just had like a photo of it, which in the instructions that we got said it wasn't good enough. So he got all pissy and he had to go get his QR code. It's like, there's clearly Photoshop. Like, <laughs> like yeah. you think just taking a picture. Oh yeah, this is for sure. Legit. Don't right? worry. Yeah, 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 exactly. Um, I've had one guy actually give me a real, it was, it was an old guy. Give me a fake ass card. Now no these way. cards are pretty standard, normal looking cards. They mm-hmm. look like business cards. They have the same card texture. Um, and they're filled out fully. This guy handed me what was clearly a piece of paper that was not cut to the same size that was laminated to hide the fact that it wasn't a card and was not filled out correctly. And I called him out. I was like, this looks fake. And I told him like four reasons why. And he got all pissy. And I was like, you know what? In my head, this is my inner dialogue. Bro's like 65. Hasn't probably, they probably didn't even card back then. They didn't have ID back then. Probably not, right? Like it was like it was easy to fake. Yeah, there was like, like no pictures on yeah, it. Yeah, like, he's like the yeah. last pandemic right. I was in. Nobody even noticed. Right, like he was here like World War One. Like this guy didn't yeah. get carded in World War One. Like yeah. whatever. Anyways, so I'm like clearly he's just trying to relive the nostalgia of getting booze underage and having a fake ID. Whatever, let this man live. He's got two weeks before these cards don't matter and they have to be digital anyway. Mm-hmm. So whatever. Um, and he handed me his wife's uh thing, which was like what seemed to be a part of an email that was like kindly kind of medical, but like looked really sus too. surprisingly less sus than his fake ass card though. (laughs) (laughs) But I was like, honestly, whatever, give me your fake ass card. I don't even care right now. Um, but there was one guy that tried to fake me out last night and it was really stupid. Everyone, you know, it was like two two or three guys, two to three. Perfect. No problem. They got their shit. They had their ID. Good to go. The last guy, he um he scans his QR code and I see the name and I check his ID. It's a completely different name. And I'm just like classic. Yeah. Um it's not you. What do you mean? Names don't match. Clearly not you. You can't use your friend's QR code, but it doesn't work like that. What are you talking about? Do you want to scan it again so you can come see the name? Because it's not yours. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> well, Sorry, bro. Not tonight. <laughs> like, yeah, what do you do at that try point? Try again right? next time. And he's like, so what? You're not allowed in. Well, what are we going to do? And he's just like staring me down like he's trying to intimidate me. Yeah. And I'm just looking at him like, this guy's so skinny. Like, his shoulder width is probably half of mine. He's like 130 pounds. I'm, I'm just staring at him like, what? <laughs> what are you going to do? You're going to sell me up? 130 and he's ready to throw it in. <laughs> yeah, well, it's pretty standard. QR code like, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, pretty standard. <laughs> Kyle knows about that. Then, uh, <laughs> but, 145, um, asshole. <laughs> I remember when I was in grade four. Anyways, I was a fat kid. <laughs> <laughs> grade four, sure. I think four. Yeah, 140 at grade four? <laughs> okay, yeah. All right, math adds up. <laughs> um, but yeah, I was like, I don't know what you do. You're like, I'm just thinking to myself, is this guy going to assault me He's over his QR code? I'm the only server here. I sent yeah. everyone home. So if you beat me up, there's no one to serve you anyway. Yeah, he's just <laughs> like, hoping for that awkward silence. It's like, well, but this one time, right? Yeah. See, this throws me back to when uh, when I got Brit fake ID. Because I, I, turned, I turned 19 <laughs> and immediately I'm like, hey, I need to figure this out because I want to go to the bars. She can't go. Let's figure it out. So found a guy that knew a guy that knew a guy. Ends up super dumb of me back then but it worked out the guy's like oh yeah it'll be 250 bucks you get two two ids completely scannable i'm like okay so i send him the money okay. i sent him 250 just on a whim of hope like he didn't even give me his real name he even told me it's a fake name fake account so that he can do it i'm like okay send him the money two and a half months later just two ids show up i'm like Awesome! This oh, oh just, I, I honestly yeah. thought that story was going in the. I just lost my money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I should have. He deserved to rob me because I just gave him, like, gave the prince of Egypt my money and said, "Hey, can the you give me prince of Egypt?" But then, uh, but these codes, they, it was Alberta, some where what buttfuck place in yeah, Alberta, some place they won't look into. They, but it has 
Britt's full name. Everything, everything is exactly like hers, just the year ahead. Cool. We go to scan, and it scans perfectly. And they're like, "Can we see a second piece?" Because we're at Corky's. We, I clearly live here. Hers says she's older. She looks younger. So <laughs> scan the second piece, and then they're like, "Okay, go through." So do that a couple times, and then we're like, we go back to Corky's probably a month or two later, and like, how long are you staying in Chilliwack? Because like it says you're in Alberta, <laughs> all this, like, oh, for a long time. And then it was a girl that I went to school with. And she's oh, like, no. I know that you're not 19. She's like, I am according it to this ID. It literally says I am. <laughs> we, we talk like half hour of them just scanning and deciding what to do. And we're like, it's scanned. You're good. You got to let us in. <laughs> so we were those assholes that just stood there while you tried to kick us out. <laughs> Cheat the system. That's so funny. I definitely would have taken your ID away. <laughs> I know. <laughs> well, fuck. Well, how thorough was the scanners attention. back then? Like, no, like it was good enough that you had to do two. Like mm-hmm. we had they. Uh, it, it's supposed to scan like your. Uh, it was right after or right before you can get the license with the care card together. Yeah. So like I don't know exactly how great it was, yeah. but they'd scan it. They'd pretend to look at it. Probably just making sure it matches with some sort of sin number. Yeah. Where like it, there's no name, so it's like, oh yeah, this number that it's associated is real yeah, yeah. To go, i have right? no idea how so they no did proof. it but if you guys need a guy i could <laughs> I I go find back a guy. To the old DL. <laughs> <laughs> like you want to go to oh, lose on a no. 9 9 30 p.m that's I so got funny you. yeah <laughs> oh, man yeah it's yeah. a weird thing it's uh restaurants have been kind of weird lately yeah a lot of people are assuming that like like the people who are very very against it where it's like you're infringing on my rights it's like man you don't have any fucking rights when it comes to a, like a private property that you're going to People have just, they're so used to living the same life and all of a sudden life's different now. And it's like, you can't do this to me. It's, well. And do you guys you offer do? takeout? Yeah. So like yeah, fucking see? that's the easiest thing in the world to get around. Just yeah. fucking order takeout and sit on the patio. <laughs> you don't even have to go home. Um, there <laughs> not, was, not the patio, but like on yeah, the, the ground. There was uh, these old guys that came uh, last night as well. And the one guy had his stuff. Um, but his buddy, he's, I was like, and you have your... Uh, vaccination card he's like oh no I, I i don't have it with me okay do you have some kind of uh or no he said he was out from out of town i'm like okay do you have some kind of uh proof of vaccination like you just need anything like mm-hmm. i've seen people from every province you know yeah. from here to ontario like yeah. they all have something yeah and it's all verifiable like, just, just show me anything with your name on it i honestly don't even look at the because like i think it's like Alberta and Ontario have had there's some people that just have like it looks like a medical document that has it on there and it's too much for me to read so I'm just looking for a name as long as it says your name and has like COVID stuff on it I don't actually care like it's <laughs> show me something I don't yeah. know yeah <laughs> um he was just like no sorry I don't, I don't have it with me I'm like okay well unfortunately you need at least something you gotta show me something and then finally he beat around the bush long enough he's like well, I'm actually exempt from vaccinations so I'm like ah there it is go home uh, <laughs> but um. Then his buddy comes back in. Can we just get like 12 Bud Lights to go? <laughs> nice, nice. But then he saw the price because it's you know, restaurant beers. Yeah, He's like, yeah. actually six. <laughs> Didn't want to spend $90 on a 12 pack. Nice. <laughs> it's pretty tough.